everybody, it's me Stacy here at Scrapbooking Made Simple outside our store and this is the YouTube to give you a tour of the store. Now I have to tell you we're not done yet so I'm going to show you around but keep in mind there's still boxes and all sorts of stuff that needs to be taken care of. But I am outside the store and I am going to turn it around so you can see where the beginnings are, okay? So we're going to start from the beginning. So I'm going to turn it around. I hope I don't get you dizzy. Stay with me. I don't know if you can see my car, but I passed my car. Okay. All right, so there's our front doors. And there's our sign. <laughs> and for seven years, these were the front doors that everybody would come through when they came shopping at Scrapbooking Made Simple. These are no longer our front doors. Um, we, as you can see, main entrance has moved. So now you walk all the way down there which is what I'm gonna do and show you the new store. So there's our new signage, very exciting. And the store is currently closed right now. We just finished class, our Tim Holtz class with Colleen. So everybody has left and now you walk in. So the first thing you see when you come into Scrapbooking Made Simple are these tables here that I'm showing right now. These are the tables we do our make and takes on the first, second, and third Saturday of every month. And we had a make and take yesterday. It was great. We used um, smooch, paper smooches, dies, and stamps, and there'll be a YouTube on that. But the goodies are still out. Usually the tables are full of candy and all sorts of stuff. <laughs> and we seat 12 at a time, and the girls come in and do the free make and take. What's behind these tables on the main wall, one of the main walls when you walk in, is our die wall. And I'm just gonna slowly walk down. Now, on the top is the dies, and then underneath are paper racks going all the way down. This wall is like 30 some odd feet, and it's nothing but paper and dies and embossing folders. So I'm gonna scroll on down. So you can see there's memory box and uh, dynamics and diversions and the new X cut dies and spell binders and Sizzix with the paper racks underneath and cute little decorations on the top. <laughs> Very homey. And over here we're getting into, so this was the make and take that we did yesterday. These are some of the samples and of course these will be on a YouTube so you'll see these samples again. So when you see them again, be surprised like you've never seen them the first time. And then we have a little area, a little seating area over here, but we've got all the dies. Now keep in mind that this isn't all the dies we carry. It's all the dies we have space for to display. So, I mean, if I listed, if I put every Sizzix die that, that we currently own, it would in fact take up the entire wall. So we put a little shelf here and we've got a lot of the dies on the shelf as well. Ooh, I hope that's not too fast. But that is our die wall and it's a very popular wall. <laughs> All the yummy product. And then over here, is another view of the tables, but this is from my demo cart. This is where I am every Saturday, all day long, and I'm looking out at a bunch of happy faces smiling back at me, and this is where I do my demos, right from my demo cart, and I've got my little demo cart full of stuff there. Hope oh, that's the phone ringing, oh well. And another little demo cart there. So that's where I spend a lot of my time on Saturdays and that's looking out, we, those were the doors we came through. So now I'm gonna kind of turn it around. And of course we've got lots of gondolas, which are the displayers, these white displayers. We've got lots of them through the store with tons of different merchandise on them. But our next wall that goes almost as long as the die wall is our stamp wall. And over here we start with Elizabeth Craft Designs and all the shimmer sheets and the velvet sheets and the glitter and the dyes. And then we move into the stamp wall. So we have lots of stampendous going on. Sorry about the empty spaces, but we haven't restocked from Saturday. <laughs> the girls will restock the walls tomorrow on Monday. But I wanted to get this done for you so you could see. So there's the stamp wall. And again, paper racks all underneath. And I'm just gonna kind of peruse on the stamp wall so you can see all the different brands we carry. And there's our Viva Decor stuff, 
our inky antics tons of product I mean and it just it goes forever <laughs> it really it really does it goes forever as you can see all the stickles and the fireworks and then we get into all the memento inks just right stamps are up there look at all the memento memento goes for a long time in this store we've got a lot of different memento unity stamps and then at the very end the brand new prima stamps the doll stamps that just came in so that is the stamp wall and it has all of our inks and all of our um, uh, glitter pins and things like that along with all the stamps that we carry well not all the stamps because they're on some of the H racks the gondolas as well then the back wall has all of our bling just a whole bunch of bling and some storage and then there's the one of the bathrooms we have two bathrooms here but you probably didn't really care about that and there's some authentic paper so we've got lots of gondolas filled with lots of stuff there's some of the dazzlers hot off the press and this is the upcoming YouTube that I'll be doing on Tuesday so there's some of the product for the upcoming YouTube tons of the gondolas full of yummy yummy goodies and they change all the time oh my gosh I think we're like Costco or or Walmart or whatever you can't come in the store and find the thing in the same place twice we're moving it all the time over here is our bay of stickers so we've got our stickers on the little racks and they're all organized by what type of sticker so if you wanted Disney you just look down Disney and you just thumb through and pick off what you like so we've got our sticker shelf here and of course below it more paper <laughs> we have over 2,000 sheets of paper here in this store and this is where we have all of our adhesives on this little unit here but I have to tell you this this cube here <laughs> my husband and our handyman built um, it used to be or what's inside of it is as a pole a support for the store and the pole is about six inches in diameter and we named it the stripper pole and I probably shouldn't say that but I am <laughs> so it, and that's what it looked like it looked like a stripper pole so um, before we encapsulated it in this new cube that they built me so I could put my adhesives on it we all signed the stripper pole so um <laughs> So if somebody ever pulls away the slat wall, which would be a crying shame, but if they do, um, there's some interesting comments that we took a Sharpie and we, we said goodbye to the stripper pole. I love my new cube. Here we've got some, here we've got some color me paper and some bow bunny. So the store's kind of in a really big L shape. Here we go. And our, our cardstock wall and see there's the dazzles the really big dazzle sheets and again this is the other side of the sticker shelf so they're stickers on both sides and the sad thing well not sad for sad for everybody I guess is that I have empty paper racks when we moved the store over it turned out I could fit um, I guess 300 sheets for 350 sheets more of paper and I haven't had a chance to buy anything to fill them so it's a sad day looking at empty paper racks <laughs> we've got scrapbooks along the top and all of our yummy all of our yummy paper and that actually goes around the corner so we're walking towards the front of the store again and there's another H rack See, there are the doors that I came in. And we've got our uh, Penny Black stickers over here and some Sizzix storage. And then we turn to the wall of Tim Holtz. <laughs> Me and Tim Holtz, we, uh, we've given him a whole little section here at Scrapbooking Made Simple. Everything from the dyes to the inks to the stamps to his embellishments. And we just had the Tim Holtz class, so it's looking a little empty especially the distress ink my gosh it looks like it got cleaned out but all of his dyes are here on the wall of Holtz 
and that little window was put into this wall because that is where I sit back here and that way I can peek out and say hello to everybody that walks in the store and now we're getting closer we're up to the front of the store where we have our cash register and our Copics we've got our Copics here and then on the other side of the cash register and those little red things and that we always have cookies and goodies out for everybody here at the store so if you want a cookie or a little chocolate or something those are always filled with yummies and our cash register and then our other curio that has the rest of our Copic markers and then last but not least in the store we have our sale racks. These four racks are everything that we have on sale. And boy, we fill them and then they go, they, they get filled and, and people shop from them all day long because we mark everything right away at 50% off. If it gets to the sale rack, it's marked at 50% off and because um, it's time for it to go. So now I'm gonna go into what's our classroom and our crop room and this used to be our main store. So we did a flip flop. Everything I just showed you used to be the class and crop room and what I'm going into now used to be the main store and to kind of bridge that I have got some curios that have all my shop hop awards and my shop hop shoes and our um, our LA hot list awards because we were voted the best uh, scrapbooking store in all of Los Angeles for uh, this is our second year that we've won and hopefully we're going for a three-peat I've got my some flowers over on this gondola and then we go into what is our class and crop room and we've got our ribbon walls in here and I say walls because we have two of them there's one and then I walk over and here's the second one who knew we had so much ribbon and I have to tell you I was so worried we didn't have enough ribbon for the store that I went out and bought more before I saw how much we actually had Holy smokes, if you can't find your color of ribbon, <laughs> you really weren't looking for a ribbon. <laughs> so our ribbon wall, and of course it's still a work in progress. We still have some things we're working on. I'm going to just quickly take you into the back office. And this is where the SMS girls and I sit and the cabinets are still being done. They haven't been finished yet. They've got to be stained and coated and cabinets up here are all new and there's the window I told you that I look through and there is my desk <laughs> with tons to be done on it so now I just roll back in my chair and I can peek through the window and see everybody and we made two huge cork walls those that wall is all cork and this wall is all cork so we can put messages and notes and all sorts of things but then this is the new class and crop room. And again, it's kind of messy. We're not done with it yet, but we're getting there. And on the walls, we have all the information from prior YouTubes so that customers can come in and they can see what we did on the YouTube. They can read about what YouTube it's from and what the product is, and they can see the samples. So as I do more YouTubes, we'll finish out the rest of the wall. We've got room for 16 YouTubes. And then when it, we're at the very last one, we'll start again and take the oldest one down and begin again. And over here is our kit and our stationary wall. So let me see if I can back up. I hope this is not, I'm gonna watch this and hopefully it's not too dizzy. So we've got our stationary wall and our kits from Pinecone Press, all of our cards and our open stock stationery. And it's all in this room where we do all our classrooms and our cropping. Now this is for National Scrapbook Day. <laughs> this is all the new Sizzix that's here for National Scrapbook Day because Sizzix Ellison is gonna be in the house doing the free make and take. So this is all here for that. And then, boy, these tables have to be cleaned. We have, uh, we have 36 for crop next week, and these tables have to get cleaned. This is all the stuff that's just kind of been thrown over here. And then these tables will get cleaned because they need to sit people for the crop. But this is all product that's come in that has to make its way upstairs to the new warehouse. 
So this is all product that has come in that has to be organized and sorted and moved and I'm hoping to get that done on Monday. That would be tomorrow. Now I'm going to turn the camera and remember this is a work in progress. So we all have rooms where you just kind of throw everything in it and close the door. Sadly, this room doesn't have a door I can close. <laughs> But this is my catch-all room until we finish and it's just got everything in it We've got to get all this stuff upstairs. Those are the original doors right there Those were the doors that you would originally walk through but all of this stuff really has got to find its way Upstairs there's our refrigerator our kitchen because we'll put a little we'll put a cute little table like right in this area And when everybody's cropping we put out a really nice spread for them a really nice um, Chips and crackers and cookies and apples and oranges and bananas and muffins and bagels and that's all part of our free crop So now I'm working my way back up to the front and, and this is scrapbooking made simple. It's 3,700 square feet of just sheer happiness. It gives me joy to come here every day. And I love my SMS girls and our customers are fabulous. And our online customers are incredible. And this is it. This is what we've accomplished. And I'm really, really proud of it. And um, I hope you can see the pride in everything that we've done. And I'm going to turn the camera back to me. And slowly okay are we back to me yet hold on hold on yeah we are <laughs> I'm gonna say this is Stacy at scrapbooking made simple and this is our store and if you are ever in Southern California please stop by come and say hi to us we'd love to see you we'd love to show you around if you can come on a Saturday usually there's a make and take being done and we really try to do really good make and takes <laughs> They take like a half an hour to 40 minutes each, so they're not a fast make and take, but they're a good make and take, and we try to show you how to use all the product. And if you can't visit us here in the store, well, then you can visit us online at www.shopatsms.com. The word shop, the word at sms.com. So I hope this is what everybody was looking for. You wanted a tour of the store, so I hope this is, I hope I did it proud. And um, I'll see you on Tuesday. Today is the 21st, April 21st. I'll see you on Tuesday with a brand new YouTube. And we will be using Ruby Rocket pre-embossed cards. So that's coming up, all right? Take care, everybody. And um, thank you for all of your support over the past uh, month or so. Actually, two months. I appreciate it. And we're getting there. It's almost done. <laughs> all right, take care. Bye-bye.